I'm joined now on PPMA TV, brought to you by our friends at Markham Image, by Anton from Tendering Pacific. Anton, thank you very much for joining us. Tell us a bit about what you do, first of all. Uh, morning. Uh, we are an uh, in independent uh, distributor and service centre for Mocon Dan Sensor uh, in the UK, Northern Ireland, uh, also uh, representing uh, TriVision. Uh, both companies are market leaders uh, into uh, the uh, food uh, preparation uh, in industry. Uh, uh, Mocon Dan Sensor are the world leader in gas flushing uh, control um, and, uh, and optimization. Uh, and Dry Vision also being a market leader uh, in end of line uh, uh, visual inspection. Uh, our customers are really facing what, what looks like existential threats now to their, to their business uh, with the lack of uh, labour, uh, the increasing cost of labour, the uh, increasing cost of raw materials and the enormous increase in uh, carbon dioxide uh, costs. Uh, so uh, our whole raison d'etre is to uh, be able to uh, help them overcome those, those issues. We have answers for pretty well most of the issues that people face. Okay, so automation efficiency, you know, we, we, you mentioned the CO2 crisis, which it certainly is for, for, for many of your customers, I'm sure. What are the ways in which then you're able to help the industry to overcome some of these challenges that they're facing with regards to skill shortages and then, like you say, rising cost of materials and gases? Histor historically, uh, food processors um, have done offline checks. Uh, we're, uh, now, really, people have to move onto online uh, quality assurance rather than quality control. If you monitor in real time, then you can control in real time. Yep. Uh, it's, always, it's always more efficient and less expensive to get it right first time. Exactly, so in terms of then the, the, the online, inline quality assurance, what are, the, what are the techniques, what are the tools, what is it that you're able to offer cu customers well, for those efficiencies? Very, uh, very, uh, uh, we've got to start at the very beginning, which is mixing gas. We have uh, uh, new technology, gas, uh, gas mixing, the map mix Prevectus, which is highly accurate um, and uh, is not, uh, it eradicates a lot of the issues with old technology mixers. So getting the gas mix right at the, at the front end is, if you don't get that bit right, yeah. it's pretty difficult to then correct it subsequently. And then in terms of, you mentioned some of the equipment that you've got on the stand here. We've got uh, this system behind us over here and we've got some other systems here. What are we looking at? What are the purposes of, of these? The, uh, this is uh, leak detection. We have a number of different uh, leak detection options. Uh, this is the Leak Pointer 3 and Leak Pointer 3 Plus. Uh, and uh, that uh, is a non-destructive offline, offline test for MAP, gas flush product, which contain carbon dioxide. Uh, our Vizio pointer. Okay, let's, let's have a wander over, over here and take a look at this. Here we go. So we've got some, uh, got some cheese in there at the moment by the looks of it, Anton. T tell me more. So the, uh, uh, the Vizio pointer, end of line visual inspection system. Uh, the uh, manufacturers of the Vizio pointer have been on en online, on end of line uh, visual inspection for almost two decades now. Pretty clever uh, software geeks. Uh, uniquely, in, ad in addition to doing the standard online um, inspections of uh, barcodes, labels, etc., uh, we also do seal inspection. Uh, because seal inspection, product entrapment uh, 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 is the primary cause of leaks uh, in, uh, in uh, 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 tray seal and thermoform products. So if you're able to, if you're able to spot those, pull them out of the, the, the uh, production stream, it doesn't end up with the retail and the consumer, but it also gives you a lot of data so that you can correct 
back in the, in the process. We are able to do that at over 200 packs a minute. Good throughput, good throughput. Um, you mentioned some of the the challenges there with regards to you mentioned some of the challenges there with regards to skill shortage and with regards to raw materials there i guess an event like the ppma show is a great opportunity for the industry to come together and to try and work out some of the ways to address some of these challenges because it's changing quickly the world has changed even since this time last year there are a lot of new challenges you know co2 again is another great example of that or a really bad example but i guess it's events like this where the industry comes together whether it's chatting together with colleagues on the show floor or going over to the seminar theaters and, and listening to other experts talking about it that's certainly one of the values of being here would you agree with that yes uh, certainly there's it's about an exchange of ideas uh, because uh, it frequently a piece of equipment that can actually do to deliver many benefits uh, to the customer, so not simply what it says on the label. Uh, now, a gas mixer, of course, mixes gas, but actually, it can it done in the correct way. It's it's able to also save uh, the, uh, the the user a significant amount of money. Good stuff. Well, listen, Anton, thank you very much indeed for chatting with us today. I hope it's a, a very fruitful day here at the show. Lots more of those conversations to be had with your customers. Uh, all the best. Thanks again. Thank you very much indeed. Appreciate it. Cheers. Thank you.